We have a very special guest coming up on today's show, coming off his huge win, teaming with Finn Balor at the Royal Rumble. Here's a sneak preview of what Buzz had to say when I caught up with him right after the Rumble. Do I think I've seen the last of Bray Wyatt? Man, I hope so. These past few months have really taken a toll on me, both physically and emotionally. But now that I've defeated him and managed to help out my friend Cole, I hope I can move on to a new challenge. As uh, as you move on to new challenges, do you see Finn Balor being there by your side? I'd like him to be, because as we all saw at the Royal Rumble, I think we make a really good team. But he's a busy guy, and he has his own goals and his own priorities. If I had to guess, though, I'd say you haven't seen the last of Buzz and Balor joining forces. Well, listen here, I'm a, I'm a big fan of yours, Buzz, and, uh, and I'm not just saying that because you're a guest on my show. I, I've been saying that uh, since you got to WWE. In fact, uh, even before that. Well, I'm a big fan of yours, too, Jack. From back in the day when you were commentating to now with your podcast, I never miss an episode, and I've heard all the kind things you've said about me. So thanks for that. Hey, I've been around the block a few times, and uh, I think I know talent when I see it. And uh, after what you did at the Royal Rumble, finding your inner demon to defeat Bray Wyatt, uh, I don't think it's a stretch to say you're the new monster among men in WWE. (laughs) The new monster among men. That's quite the compliment, Jack. I don't know if I've earned it yet, but I'll take it. Thanks again. Now, you can hear more from my conversation with Buzz, including who he thinks his next opponent will be. But uh, first, a word from our fine sponsors. Shame us, but they don't speak the language. 
After his huge win at the Royal Rumble, Buzz is ready to address the WWE Universe. I was recently on a podcast where they said that after I unleashed my inner demon to defeat Bray Wyatt, that I was now the new monster among men in WWE. You can either agree or disagree with that statement, but it got me thinking. If I really want a nickname like that, I have to earn it. Which brings me to Braun Strowman. What better way to become the new monster among men than to defeat the old monster among men and become universal champion? So I might be crazy, but Braun, I'm calling you out. Let's find out face to face if I am what they say I am. It's all about the game, and how you play it from a hundred years. That is not Braun Strowman. No, but he's just as dangerous, possibly more. The new monster among men, huh, Buzz? It sounds like someone's gotten a little full of themselves. Now, I'll admit, you've had some success. But that's because you've had it way too easy under Kurt Angle. And sure, you've had some tough battles, and I've stripped you of your title when you were injured. But Kurt's pretty much been looking out for you the entire time. Well, that all changes now. Because I'm going to personally make sure that nothing on Raw is ever easy for you again. That means no more of you getting to request matches, let alone title shots whenever you want. In case you need a reminder, you don't have that kind of authority. I do. So if you want a shot at Braun Strowman and his universal title, it'll be on my terms. First, you'll have to win a handicap match tonight versus the bar. Triple H is stacking the deck against Buzz. You tried to stop What's new? me at every turn. From the Indies to NXT to SmackDown and now here on Raw and I'm still standing. This time will be no different. I'll overcome whatever you put in front of me to become the Universal Champion. That's great. But you didn't let me finish. It's not going to be a two-on-one handicap match. It's going to be a three-on-one. Because you're facing the bar and Samoa Joe. And by the way, that match is going to happen right now. I told you I'd never forget what you did. Buzz has to beat the bar and Samoa Joe. There's no way he pulls this off. I'm going to have to agree with you, Corey. These odds seem truly insurmountable. What's the strategy for Buzz in a match like this? It's simple. Pray for a miracle. You've got to believe this one's over. Boom! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, what a chop block. What are we going to see here? Hung up on a snip breaker. From behind. Ooh. Shoulders down, roll up. Boy. Referee barely had time to begin a count there. Nah, not yet. Too early. Ooh, nasty impact. A high-risk maneuver that works from that top turnbuckle. There's a pin now. And he kicks out. Too early for that. Two. 
Samoa Joe looking a little startled right now. He's up against an almost unwinnable battle here in this handicap match. The important thing is that he doesn't overreact here. He's taken on a little bit of damage, but it's nothing he can't overcome. I'm not going to go so far as to say he can't win this match, but things certainly aren't looking good for him right now. Elbow drop, big time! He might have it. Absolutely spiked! DDT! Victory is on the horizon. The situation just got real bad for Sheamus. Big boot! Harsh impact! What a stomp! Good grief! Sheamus starting to weaken some. I don't know about you, but I don't like his chances of survival here in this handicap match. He may very well find himself on the wrong end of this decision if he doesn't come up with something quickly. He seem more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Ooh, what an uppercut! He's taking some offense. He definitely has his work cut out for him here in this handicap match. Well, I don't think his performance here tonight is necessarily one I would point to if I were to instruct an up-and-comer on how to win a handicap match. Shoulders are down. Sheamus gets the shoulder up. It's difficult to keep the Celtic warrior on the mat. You can say that again. He doesn't look too eager to get up, and I don't blame him. There it is, the Camaro Plex is complete. This just might be enough for him to take the victory here. Can Sheamus stay in this after that? Doubtful. What a driver. That'll put Sheamus in a bad mood. Someone's going to be black and blue tomorrow. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, 
nasty impact. Boom, what impact! And Sheamus slips out of harm's way. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. Twist the fake. Oh, what impact. Technique. Oh no, we know what this is. Incredible drop. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Here it comes, he's got him. He's almost got him. Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. What a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Oh, did you see that? Yeah. Byron, that was unreal. That has got to be it. Can Sheamus stay in this after that? Doubtful. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Neck breaker. We're gonna see here. Hung up on a stunner oh, breaker. Oh. And Sheamus reverses it. Oh, he turns it around. Boom! <laughs> this might be it. Oh my. Sheamus can't waste any time here. Oh, what an uppercut. He's in a very bad way here, guys. The big question is how much longer can he go here in this handicap match? Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. He has him right where he wants him. He wants no part of this. Oh, incredible height. Now it's time to capitalize. That'll knock you loopy, Cole. Harsh impact. He's been taken to the limit here in this handicap match. Listen to this crowd. They can see this handicap match is starting to slip away from him. At this point, they both look to be about evenly matched. Maybe I'd give him an edge, but not by much. This might be it! Oh, my! Oh, what impact. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. You gotta believe this one's over. <laughs> no, there's the reversal. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Seamus appears to be admiring his work. The running senton! Crushing impact. 
Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh, man. Giant suplex. Oh, look at this. Second suplex. This is not going to be good. There it is. The Camaro Plex is complete. And there it is, boys. Oh, man. Joe doesn't even know where he is. From above. Yeah. Harsh impact. Yeah. Really working over the body. can be a little much to take, especially at times like this. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. Nailed it. What are we going to see here? Hung up on the... That's going to leave a mark. Look out, down he goes. And he might not get back up. What a scary drop. What does Buzz have in store? We're, We're going to move. <laughs> if that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Drop like a bad habit. in the electric chair. Oh, what a driver. This one's over, guys. And you thought the first one was brutal. What are we going to see here? Hung up on a step breaker. He's playing with him now. Don't you dip oh, that impact! But can he follow up here? Beautiful technique. That might have done it, Cole. Well, the cover. One, two, three! An unbelievable handicap match victory. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. He ain't playing here. Check this out. He's getting it done here. I really enjoyed every minute of this. I don't know how, but somehow Buzz did it. I can't believe it. Now let's see if Triple H gives him the universal title shot. Oh no. It's the universal champion. Braun Strowman! I don't think he's out here to congratulate Buzz on his win. Oh! Oh, and look at the punches! Teeing off! What's next? Oh, no! Oh. Incredible power slam! So much torque! Triple H looks on with approval as Braun Strowman has sent a message to Buzz that there's only one monster among men in the WWE Universe. 